Okay, so next let's think about what you do when you're studying. Some people just read through their notes or textbooks and underline in pencil or highlight important bits. If this works for you, fine. But I'd suggest that it's better to write notes of some kind, so your mind is processing the information more. This way, you are also producing material which will be useful for last-minute revision. I don't recommend very last-minute revision, by the way, but we'll come back to that later. Have a look at these examples of student notes. Which do you think are best? The first person has written important phrases at random. The next has a table with clear headings and boxes with notes. The next has summaries. And the last one has mind maps. You've got the main topic in the circle then lines coming off the circle attached to subcategories, then more lines to further details. Mind maps are great for showing the connections between different bits of information. They seem to work in the same way the brain works. So what do you think? Mm -hmm. To me, the first one wouldn't be very useful to come back to and use in the future, but the others are all fine. It depends on your personal preference. Mine is for mine.